What's going on guys? I just got back from getting my exhaust welded. Oh, 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 oh. So this is actually happening a whole lot sooner than I thought it was going to. I'm at my friend Chris's house right now. I brought it over for him to look at. He was just gonna look at it and buy materials and stuff to do what we needed to do. And it turns out he can just do it right now. So I was like, you know what? Let's do it. He's under the car right now with the saws off. We're getting her done. It's gonna be sick. So that's what it looks like. <laughs> what? This looks absolutely insane. It's so much lower. But that's what I needed for this diffuser. So I got this diffuser from Midnight Modified on Instagram. Super cool dude. He's got a sick Mark IV Jetta 1.8. It's like stage three. It's nuts. Go follow him. I hit him up after he upgraded diffusers and he sold me this one. So it's now gonna be on this Mark IV and I'm super pumped. Somebody's two-stepping, that's sick. So I went over to my friend Chris's house. I was just gonna get things mocked up. He was gonna order some materials and stuff and then we were gonna do it next week. But I got there and we took it off the hangers and he was like, dude, we can just do this right now. I can just weld on a piece of pipe for the hanger, just extend the hanger and it'll drop down right where it needs to be. I had the diffuser with me, we mocked it up real quick. I couldn't film much of it because I was helping him out, but we got it knocked out in like half an hour and it looks really, really bad right now. I'm like embarrassed to like drive it on the road, but whatever, it's a work in progress. Now all I gotta do is I gotta go to the junkyard, get a new rear, whatever this is called, one that doesn't have a cutout in it. I'm gonna paint it black and then we gotta mount up the diffuser to it and it's gonna be sick. It's seriously gonna look so good, guys. Oh, you have no idea. I have no idea. I have no clue. I'm not even ready. I'm not ready for this. <laughs> uh, this is gonna be so sick. I'm super psyched about it. All right, guys, I am at this junkyard. We got a lot of cars here. Now we just gotta see if they have any stock rear lips. Let's see what we got. They even got one propped up for us. Heck yeah. Nice rear lip, no cutout. It's got one little nick, but it'll sand out. Let's get it off. There it is. Man, somebody come snag this hood bra. Now we just gotta see how much he wants to rip me off for this piece of crap. So he charged me 25. I could have gotten it cheaper online probably, but it wouldn't have been OEM. I think this is gonna hold up a lot better. I was hoping for 10. <laughs> Whatever, I'm happy with it. I think it's a good lip. I need to sand down that spot a little bit and it'll look good as new. All right, guys, it's a new day. This is how I film my videos. I can't do it all in one day most of the time because I don't have a lot of time. So you're just gonna have to deal with it. But today I'm planning on finishing up the whole project. It's a Saturday. So I'm gonna start off by sanding down this rough spot right here. It's so, so small, but I just wanna do it. <laughs> that took about 10 seconds. So I'm gonna get some soapy water, spray it down and clean it up before we paint it. All right, guys, so she's all cleaned up. Behind me, we got Kyla and Thomas. Oh. Hi. <laughs> so now we're gonna put a light coat of paint on it and start ripping off the other bumper. Let's go. We're gonna get under here, yank this whole thing off. All right, put a year in the chat if you think I should just leave it off. The splitter's drying. I'm gonna pull out the floor in the trunk. All right, spare tire's out. We're just gonna be riveting this spare tire well right here. Let's get it done. Okay, so this is pretty much dry. I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. So we're gonna mount up this rear lip, then we're gonna mock up where the splitter goes on, drill some holes in there. All right guys, so the rear lip is on. It's a little dirty for me touching it, but it'll wash out. Drop the video a like if you think it looks sick already. Once we wash the car up, it'll look a whole lot better. All right, so we got her all marked up here. I forgot to show you guys the actual diffuser. I picked this off of a guy on Instagram. His handle is Midnight Modified, and he fabbed this up himself for his Mark IV. It turns out he's actually making a new one, so I hit him up and asked what he was doing with his old one, and he said, selling it to you. I'm super pumped about it. Thanks, Midnight Modified. I'm gonna use tap screws on the lip here. I'm still gonna drill some pilot holes, and I'm just gonna rivet in where the spare tire is. I just put three screws in just in case I have to move it. It's gonna get there. Let's see the other side.
So now that we got both sides kind of mocked up here, we're gonna put in the middle and see how she lines up. She's tacked up there and I am super, super, super excited. Heck yeah. Thanks to this man right here. Couldn't have done it without him. I just gotta tack up the rest of it. I'm gonna rivet the metal because I don't want the screw heads going in and popping my spare tire. I'll check back in with you guys once it's all up and ready and then we have a finishing touch to do. We'll be back. So she is up and mounted. I'm super pumped. You can barely see the rivets and there's no chance of them popping my spare tire. I'd say it was a success, but now these edges are pretty rough. They don't look very refined. And our solution for that, edge trim. This is what it looks like, it's pretty sweet. And it actually has adhesive in the top of it. So it'll stick to whatever we put it on. Right, Ginger? Got some scissors here. We're gonna cut this to length to fit on each one of these individually. All right, guys, this was a game changer. This trim on here makes it look, oh my gosh. Really happy with how that turned out. Let's get it on the ground. Whew. I think the side profile really is enhanced with the whole thing because it keeps the line going across really nice. It's not so high in the back anymore. that's going to wrap it up for this video guys thanks for watching i really appreciate you if you could throw a like down there for the youtube algorithm i would really appreciate it especially if you like the video throw me a comment what you think about it follow me on instagram and have an awesome day guys